that a man had been killed in your club. Brilliant. Right. My phone? The tip was correct. Please call the investigators. will scare my clients. Can they come in through the back door? Are there cameras here? The cameras are in the public area. There's no signal here. Oh, you were so heavy. Like a mammoth. You're so fat. Please help her. Stop. You need to wear gloves for that. And where do I find gloves? Use plastic bags. for your team in my office. Am I right? If something goes wrong, you'll put all the blame on us. Not self-defense, it appears. Mr. Suhanov, how are you connected to Thailand? Tourism. I need more details. I doubt someone is killing your staff for petty theft. What do you mean, details? I haven't been there for five years. If what you say is true, why would anybody leave this message for you? Are you serious? Just because I'm the owner of this club, you think I'm a bad guy too, is that right? Just the type that leaves corpses behind. Are you telling me I should call my lawyer? No, not yet. But you might insist on his presence. It's all starting to make sense.
Where's the other one? Which one? So, what's going on here? The bastard was wasted, boss. And? He punched the waiter right on the nose. Uh-huh. Tries to hit Alex with a bottle. Okay, and then? So they hauled him here to cool off. To cool off? Fuck. It was a setup. It seems pretty clear that the guy had a plan. But the second victim was an accident. Probably why he hid the body. He was worried that you might not decipher his message. I do not know him. Let's follow the breadcrumb trail then. Someone was walking towards him. This someone was clearly part of my staff. My guys wouldn't let him go without a fight. Uh-huh. Lots of broken light bulbs today. Where? The storage room by the dance floor. Mr. Suhano, we've been tipped. 
Dawson. Hey, hey, hey. Oh. I was saying, we've been tipped off that a man had been killed in your club. It looks like he stood... right here, behind his back. Surround yourself with amateurs. Wait, you idiot. Can you tell it's not ready yet? Do me a favor, hand me the screwdriver. Okay. Yeah. Got it? You got it, bud? Uh -huh. Thanks a lot. About an hour ago. I'd say 30 minutes, no more. Mr. Sukhanov! Mr. Sukhanov! I remember. He had a tattoo on his neck. Some sort of Chinese writing, I don't know. Mr. Suhanov, do you know anybody with a tattoo like that? I don't. it would interest him.
How did he find out? How the hell do I know? You tell me. He's gonna feed you! Feed you to the dogs for this! He's old school, you know. He blows up for every little thing! Wait, 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 stop, stop! Stop, I'll think! Fuck! That's revenge you want! You'll need a different plan when you find everything. Just bring it to the cops. They're neck high in this business. And they already took down. They already took down some of Suhanov's mules. If the goods hit the streets with a different brand, the type of bosses will punish everyone. You must have gone down the hall. It's the only possible way. Let's go. Did you not hear what I just said? This is private property. The only reason you're allowed here is to find who's killing my men. So we're gonna keep moving. And you're gonna do your fucking job.
Where are you going? Getting my daughter. Who is Maxim? The one you found in the storeroom. Hmm. We should probably head back. There's only one way out of here. Through the warehouse. In this picture, there's a young man standing next to your daughter. Who is he? As you can see, my daughter is young and beautiful. There's always a bunch of guys that want to hang out with her. I need you to go and check the stash while I distract her. Do you keep newspaper clippings about all of her suitors? Father called today. Next time around, you'll have to take even more with you. Sounds good. Yana's been in charge of the club. She's been the manager here for several months now. Are you gonna need her phone number? There's no use. She's not answering anyway. Don't worry, we'll ask her about those newspaper clippings. When she calls back. Mr. Suhanov. I believe that the time has come for you to contact your lawyer. Hey, boss. Where's the gun? Get down! Away from the window! He's close by. Close all the blinds. Lock the door. Get up now. I really 
I think we should... We need backup now. How many? All of them. I'll do everything I can within my power and more. But I'll find the bastard. But we don't need backup. Where is this room? It's a good thing you're still here. Mr. Suhanov, I believe it's a bad idea to make impulsive choices. Would you rather be gunned down then? You can go now. Either way, you've lost the game. don't know, but who knows your daughter very well, saunters through your labyrinth, as if he had a map. Mr. Suhanov, you have so many rooms here, but he was only interested in two of them. The only two rooms with video surveillance. Hmm. You hid something in there, and he found this something, am I right? While you're trying to intimidate us, our guest already emptied the second bag and escaped. It's a trick to divert attention. A wolf chased a rabbit, and it was a mistake. Let's search the second room. I'm sure he also left something for you in there. Mr. Suhanov. Before you enter this room, let me ask you one more time. Is there anything you'd like to say? There's been a shooting at Paradise Nightclub, some dead and wounded. Search the room where they stored the chairs, you'll find a stash of cocaine in the air vent. 
What's next? Let's stop by the police station. We'll pit them against the Thai drug cartel. Let them have fun. <laughs> Good evening, this is Kamishlov Daily. Could you please comment for our readers on the arrest and consequent suicide of Valerie Sverdlov? What's there to comment? We barely knew each other, you know. When did he die? Forty days ago. Ah, I read about him. He was selling drugs or something, right? No, he didn't sell drugs. He was just a courier. What's the difference? I believe that everyone involved in the drug business deserves a similar fate. Don't you agree? Thanks so much. Oh